So today is Redemption Day. Last year we tried to go to Pikes Peak and when we got there it was closed and I was super, super upset about it. This year we're gonna make it happen. We're only about an hour and a half from it. From what we can tell online, there's no events or any reason that it should be closed. So fingers crossed, by lunchtime we're sitting at the top of Pikes Peak. Shop right here in this parking lot. I don't know if they do tires, but there's an auto shop in this. Parking lot. Oh, that's amazing. So, Fun yeah. Sport S's and Sport Cup 2s are super hard to get right. Great. <laughs> Why are you laughing, dude? Because <laughs> it freaking sucks. Could be, maybe it could be patched. They do not do tires. What? Just because it doesn't say that on the side doesn't mean they don't do it. It doesn't. It, the threads are showing. Oh. Oh. Good thing it didn't pop yesterday. Yeah, that's crazy. Good thing it didn't pop at 176 miles an hour. Yeah. Like that's or 170, 80 yesterday. You got killed. They'd have rolled that thing a hundred times. So <laughs> glad that didn't. I mean, that's like literally two hours ago. That car was going 178 miles an hour. So and the threads are showing. Oh, the whole inside. No more tire issues on this trip, please. Can we all agree on that? Everybody? Dean? Yes? Brandon? Yes. Okay. We're in agreement. No more tire issues. The universe literally leads us along to the next thing. And a prime example of it is the name of this luggage here because it's the same name as our waiter from the restaurant the other night. We don't know what it means yet. No, we don't know. But what it, it means. means something. It means something. Exactly. Found a blown fuse for the cigarette lighter, so we're fixing that. Go figure, it's the German car having all the problems. I love German cars, but they always have problems. <laughs> yeah, they were black, and then... Like, what could you actually use these for? I, Dude, I feel like... you could destroy oh, people with those. They were designed to... So this was originally... They were designed to go like this. Yeah. So this was originally a farm tool. This is how you block stuff if you're a turtle. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Go ahead, I keep cutting. They were originally a farm tool that was used to hold wagon wheels on. Trying to get a hold of the service department um, to ask if they could not certain size tire and stuff, but nobody would answer. So. Why is it, out of all the places that we've called, the Mercedes Benz dealership, which should be jumping through hoops to help people, is the one that has the worst customer service? You're gonna do a burnout. Yeah, you have to do a burnout, right? It's new tire day. Where's the hijack stand? No, not here. heading to what, what do you say O tire or something big O tire to get to get those tires replaced for the AMG I mean oddly enough they both fitted that Hellcat though that's that's surprising to me but hopefully we get these things mounted and balanced real quick and we can get back on the road I can't believe he went 178 <laughs> miles per hour he's lucky on a tire that looked like that we are at we're stranded cars in a parking lot miles away they there <laughs> There's another guy. All right, we're gonna go over to McDonald's. You coming? They look good. They look good. Nice. Oh, we're gonna smoke those off. You're pretty good. Service with a smile. Now we're going to Pikes Peak. If anything else stops us from going to Pikes Peak, I'm still going to Pikes Peak.
kind of here. We made it to mile 13 of, what is this, 19 or 18, I think. So that means we have to come back, but at least we got past the front gate this time. I'm excited. The road up here was incredible. I'm in the wrong car again. So next time we're trailing the GT4 out here and we're gonna take that up here. What's making me want to do is drive it, and I'm taking, I'll take the Nashville Tour. I honestly think that road and the one that Chief Joseph's whatever. Chief Joseph in the Shoshone National Forest. Was, I think was better than the Tail of the Dragon. I agree, I, I couldn't agree more. I think you're skewed because you hate it so much driving. No, the Tail of the Dragon was cool, but you had to go so slow to some degree because it's so chief joseph you can have some serious speed on that and also some serious stuff heading home finally been on the road for seven days we are still in way past Kansas City, way west of Kansas City, so we have a really long drive, about 1,200 miles today. We're gonna stop in St. Louis to see uh, the man behind the camera's brother, then we're heading home. So beautiful and lovely I wish you could see it all the way I do So pure and true all right guys, so this is sort of a bittersweet moment. We are done with the road trip. It was an absolute blast. We're in St. Louis. We still have a couple hundred miles to go to get back home, but it's essentially over. Mr. Michael is heading home after this, so we won't see him or be driving with the AMG anymore. So we're back down to two plus Dean, our chase car. So awesome trip. This one rivals the trip to LA last year, I think. We're gonna, we're gonna have to do this more often, I think. So thank you guys very much for watching and we will see you on the next road trip. Whoever's the funniest, everyone will remember the most. I don't know, it's funny. <laughs> That's pretty good. What are you doing? What's that? That's good. The new song is alive. Well, guys, it's been nine days and a lot of miles. It's been real. It's been fun. It's been fast. And uh, I wish you guys all ready, and I can't wait for the next one. Thank you for everything. Thanks for joining us, Michael. Would not have been the same without you. I uh, can't wait for the next one either. We will see you at SEMA. Dobbins, it's always a pleasure, buddy. I will see you at SEMA. Days can be cruel I know the hours take a toll I know it's hard to open